Hello, ladies and gents. I am the Rev, and this is Elix 2, a game by Piranha Bytes, and published by THQ Nordic. It's currently $49.99 on today, March 1st, 2022. The release date, if you pick this up on February 28th, though, it is 10% off. And I figured we would jump in. It's up to you guys. You guys smash that like button. Subscribe and let me know in the comments what you're thinking of the character. If you've got any uh, ideas, if you played the first game, I played it. I didn't beat it. I played it. So I kind of know what I'm doing, but it's up to you guys. So we're just going to jump straight in and get some. Magalon, home to a civilization of millions. 166 years have passed since the comet hit, turning everything to ashes. A new era has begun. The war between the free people and the Alps is over. The hybrid lost control of its armies and ceased to function. The Alps became understanding and peaceful. The Elix was released and once again spread across the entire hemisphere below the Alps Ice Palace. But humans are quick to forget. Many of the larger settlements claimed the victory as their own and paid little interest to the affairs of others. Only a few remember those dark times, or one Commander Jax. My name and my deeds faded away in the mists of myth and legend. Many years after the war with the Alps, humankind is plagued by petty conflicts and territorial disputes. Even though there's still the persistent uneasiness about the strange celestial phenomenon that was called forth by the hybrid before its defeat, I know that an unknown foe will come soon. The lives of all the aware will be shaken to their very core. All my efforts to prepare humanity for this impending danger were for naught. Humans forget. A vague, unknown threat looming in the sky quickly became nothing but a small, daily nuisance to most. Until now.
Damn it. I better get out of here before these things make short work of me. All right, guys, we're just grabbing everything we can here. Shit. This damn tower landed right on my fucking house. Guess I can forget about my gear. Yeah, there's nothing we can get from there. Want to get all the arrows we can, because these will help. But I'm telling you guys, man, I love these kinds of games. And you have to holster your weapon to uh, pick anything up. And then you want to grab any and all plants you come across simply because. Let's you get can the hell out of here. Then. train of thought. It's all good. Basically, just grab everything that you can at the beginning. And it does use a uh, weapon wheel, which is all the rage right now. Let's see. What kind of crap is up here? But the first guy we uh, run into, we're going to want to be able to buy as much armor and stuff as we can. Ugh, even more of those beasts, of course. Hmm. We should probably try to sneak by them. The problem is, is, I don't know if that's even possible to sneak by those guys. It sets off a cutscene where they chase us, and they're going to try and, uh... I think that's where we came through. That is where they are. That's the creatures right there. But it's only going to let us go so far, and then it's going to set off a cutscene. Oh, look at that. Crap up here. I didn't know there's stuff up here. Elix is the main form of currency. Yeah, I don't know if we can get past this. It's too dangerous here. I better get moving before they spot me. Well, if you'd let me jump up, there we go. <laughs> didn't matter, it's still went out there. Go set it off.
Take it slowly. You haven't recovered from that bite yet. It'll be a while before you get all your strength back. So perhaps you should put off anything too demanding for a few days. Who are you? You can call me Adam. Just think of me as a friend who is in the right place at the right time. That's all you need to know. So, real quick, you guys are going to notice as we go through this that um, it doesn't tell you what options here to click on to actually get quest lines. So, you kind of got to go through all of them. So, you guys are going to be seeing me do that a lot. With a little editing here and there. Ugh, what happened? You should know. You were there. The invaders arrived started taking over the world, transforming it. Transforming? Terraforming, right? That's an alien species? Hmm. A most hostile, most dangerous species. So they're not just in Caracas? Their formers have appeared in every region, threatening life everywhere. It's not clear what they want yet. All they're doing for now is spreading infection, killing and destroying. Not a promising start. Something's not right. I feel... I feel weak. Mm, yes, you were bitten by one of those creatures. Looks like it infected you. Some kind of... disease. What? A disease? I'm still not sure how it works, but... it's clearly all part of the invaders' plan. At the rate they're transforming things, it won't be long before the whole of Magalan is overrun with their plants and animals. Oh, great. You were lucky. It could have been a lot worse. If I were you, I'd stay out of their way and not tempt fate. All other instances of direct contact so far have proved fatal. Where's my stuff? If you're talking about the belongings you had in that hut, you can forget about them. All I could save is what you have on you. How long have I been out? A few days. You're still badly hurt. I did what I could with your wounds. Days? No. Dex! Come on, I'll race you there! Be careful! <clears throat> Dex! Damn it! My son's out there somewhere. I have to find him. Then I'd say you'd better do that before anything else. Why are you helping me? These invaders are a threat to us all, and yet no one even seems to have noticed they're here. Everyone's so busy fighting each other, they can't see who the real enemy is. That's where you come in. You might be an outsider to them right now, Jax, but you're strong, smart, capable. You know who I am? I know you did your best to disappear, but not everyone's forgotten you. I need your help to save Magalan, to lead a resistance group. I call it the Sixth Power, a faction separate from all the others, focused on stopping this invasion. I'll show it to you. Meet me in the Bastion north of here. No way. I tried to warn people years ago. No one listened. Now we've got the total annihilation of the planet staring us in the face, and still, all anyone cares about is their own stupid shit. I'm done caring about it. I have my own problems. All right. Then deal with your own problems first. We can talk again later. The World Heart to the North. Is it still there? As far as I know, yes. The Berserkers are watching over it. Why do you ask? My son's with them. Then you should go. While things are still quiet around here, it won't stay that way for long. You know where to find me. You know, 
you'd get around a lot faster with a jetpack. I have one left. Take it. Like yes. I said, go to the Bastion when you're ready. We have a lot of work to do. I'll be waiting there. All right. Damn it. I'm really not doing all that great. Oh. But I don't trust the old man's judgment. I should look for a healer among the berserkers. We will do that. A sack here. But. Okay, so we got healing potions. Lifeblood chem, 300 effective while under the influence of stims. You get a 50% uh, penalty on experience. Ooh. And small red gemstone. That will go on to weapons eventually. Potato. So you don't have whoop, a whole lot of time with the jetpack to begin with. Yeah, we'll go over that a little bit. Ooh, simple bow. Over here real quick. You can go back and fight those creatures if you want at the very beginning that we ran from. Wouldn't suggest it though. Hey there, Spanky. Yep. Now you came out of here. Up oh, again. I want to grab all plants because we're basically going to be selling them off until we can learn enough to do potions. See, there's those bastards again. So, you have to assign your slots. I'm going to put that there. Let's see. And since we got so many of these, put that number two spot. Maybe we can shoot him. Oh no, I'm out. Oh wow, and there's a crap ton more of them keep showing up. Oh, get okay. Some definitely interesting and colorful 
animations for our characters. All right, anything over here? Or are we just wasting time? Oh, it's it. Looks like there's nothing else over here. Because, yeah, there is crap everywhere. This is a Lutor's Wet Dream. of an SOB over here. Oh, I want to check this real quick. <clears throat> I do wonder... What is up there? Because I don't think there's a way. There's no ladders or anything here. Get up there. Ah! Oh, I made it! Holy shit. I didn't think I'd make it. I, like, clipped right through the animation and got up here. Okay. Get that up here. Yes, no. Why does it seem like this is a secret of some sorts? You know what I'm saying? That's got to be opened at some point. Got a radio tower, something else over that direction. Some good time in there. Oh, you piece of crap! <laughs> All right, teleporter. So now, wherever we go, we see this thing right here. That means we can teleport for free back. But again, one of the issues is that there is just a never ending amount of exploratory fun that you can have. And the only thing that really limits you are the monsters that you'll run into. I mean... Really? Kind of bullshit. Alright, so we... That's the first place we want to go because it's got a bunch of stuff for us. And then that'll be our next destination. I think that's where our uh, ex-wife is. I do wonder what that piece of map was for. Nope, it doesn't say here. Oh, 
Oh, okay, here it is. It's a piece of... And a photo of my son. Yeah. Okay. Glossary beasts. Blood claw. Ugly sucker. Jacko. That looks like a werewolf. And of course, this is our log. This is as we're going here. Inventory. We got no head pieces, uh, chest piece, leg pieces. Abilities. So these are what you can be trained in. We have one ability point right now, for some reason. And then start with 10 of everything else. We'll probably... Gonna... Well, actually, what we'll do as we get weapons and such, we will... Uh, oh, wait a minute. But yeah, okay. So as we get weapons, we will use our points to f uh, fill in the gaps. All right? I'll show you guys here in a sec. Screw it! Oh, <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> I said it's all about timing, man. All about timing. Oh, there we go. Simple blade. Jax. Oh. So glad you're alive. We feared the worst. What happened here? It caught us completely off guard. During the night watch, they blindsided us. The strange intruders? No, no. The Morcons. See here? They're fallen bloodhounds. The biggest group of them is already moving back up north. Where's Dex? Where's my son? His mother took him with her. Kaya was here? With him? Yes. And she followed the Morcons north. You know she'll never rest until she's defeated them all. Can you heal me? Of course. I can give you a few flasks. But we need the rest for our wounded. Ugh. You look like shit, Jax. Ugh, I'm... I'm all right. Just got bitten by one of those damn creatures. Shit. Better get that looked at. <laughs> Shit. Better get that looked at. Not good. Of course. Thanks. Hmm. Those large purple formers. Ever see them before? Oh, when the outsiders arrived, they spread out down south. We saw a lot of their creatures when we were out hunting. Couldn't always deal with them, though. Had this whole battle of the factions to deal with. Do you have a healer who can look at my bite? The infection? Well, most are dead. But Kaya survived. She's the best mage of all of us. Show her your injuries. Why'd you stay here? I am a warlord of the Berserkers. I have responsibilities. I can't just leave the world hard defenseless after an attack like this. Men trust in my leadership. The world heart is still intact? <sighs> Thank the stars. The Morcons were only out to kill berserkers and take our horde of Alexit. The world heart is unscathed. It continues to deliver mana to the Earth. Nature will soon flourish here in Caracas. It's strange that the Morcons dared to go so far. Yes, very strange indeed. They usually keep their destructive urges inside their grotto. Something must have roused them. Probably those intruders and their bizarre creatures. Uh, maybe. But I believe they have other motives. They're religious fanatics who worship a violent god. Who can guess what motivates such people? Hmm? Well, when you meet Kaya, be patient with her. She's taken the losses over the last few days quite hard. She fought the Morcons to the very end. Tried to prevent the worst. Mm-hmm, I got you, dude. More blood. Put 
anything in here? Guess not. What was over here? Oh, plant. Nope, one more dude. Alright, that is it. So, you got one more dude you can really talk to in this area. Uh, the other guys that are walking around, and it's that guy right there. The other guys walking around aren't. Worth speaking to. And before you talk to him, I suggest let us loot in here. Anything else? No. That's right, get that toilet paper. Even if the world ends, people still gonna need toilet paper. What do we get? Okay, so. Strength modifier. Oh, we want that. Mana, scrap, more leading. All right. Okay. So, modifier. That is this. And you just hold it down. And boom. Now we got a plus five to our strength. That's a 15. This is what I was talking about. So we've got a sword that'll take 25 and 17. The other sword is only going to take... A very small amount, so we'll put... Oh, I haven't got my first level yet. Never mind. We'll get that very soon, though. And this is it. Create a modifier. Search written the list on the left. Detail view on the right will show you the qualification material you need to create. So, right, we got a damaged lead pipe here, right? We can make it into a little bit better of damaged lead pipe. But it's kind of like... It's not really worth it to begin with, I don't think. I think I'm going to save my money. You've really got to watch your back around here. Caracas is a tough place. Aye. Trouble? Obviously. It takes its toll. We can always use more people. But, though we may be few, at least I have materials for weapons so we can fend off external attacks. Do you have a weapon for me, too? I don't give weapons away for free, if that's what you're asking. But I've got a little forge, and you're welcome to use it if you want. If you don't know how it works, I might be able to teach you something, but I won't do it for free. So you should have a little experience and a couple of shards in your pocket. If you're looking to buy something, I've got a few things lying around, but I need most of what I've got for the boys. All right. Did you teach me something? What do you want to know? Here we go. So you have found your first trainer. Trainers help you to learn skills. You can look at the skill description to find out what qualifications you need to learn a skill, what it costs, and what trainers can teach it to you. So the only one, let's see, he could teach us this, right? Yes. And he can teach us this. And we can craft simple weapons. Uh, level two, you can craft better weapons. Level three, you can craft the most complex of weapons. And that's awesome. But it's like, why throw the, why use my skill point on that? Because this is what I want. But all these can't be from this teacher. Only these guys right here. Create ammunition. Build grenades, which will be real helpful. But let's buy some stuff buy instead. Some stuff. Of course. All right, so we got two ninety nine. Buy some, buy a helmet, some legs. Ooh, different recipes. Uh, flat out fuel, and the fuel you need twenty five in intelligence to be able to upgrade your jetpack. And that's something you're going to want to do because, my God, man, some of the stuff I've seen people flying around and shit is just wicked. Okay, so we'll accept the trade to begin with here. 
the first one. And now... I want to buy some stuff. Of course. We're going to go in. And we're going to sell. All right. And 641. That's pretty good. I want to buy some stuff. Of course. And the only other thing I think I wanted to buy... Wait a minute, range combat, no. The only thing I ever wanted from him otherwise was, yeah. Plus nine for a body armor. All right. And that's it. Okay, so this is what he currently looks like. There he is, all gussied up. So to use this bow, we need three more dexterity. We still haven't done that yet. So have our damage left pipe. Okay. But you see, we haven't killed enough yet. But it's all good. This dude's just over here chomping. Good to see you. Are you sure about that? But alrighty, folks. So hit that like button, subscribe to the old channel. We will crank these out as fast as you guys want them. This is one of the ones I can sit and make a crap ton at once, uh, given some of the time eases or eases on my time. But, you know, things are crazy as always. So just hit that like button and keep your heads down. Your weirdo looking SOBs up. And I'll see you again real damn soon.